Good morning. Today is Wednesday, January 16th. Hmm. Um, no water aerobics today because um, we had freezing rain last night and so um, the roads were too bad so Bertie and I didn't go. We thought last night when we saw the news we thought that there wouldn't be any swim class today anyhow because we figured the school would be closed so we just decided not to go and then the schools were open but it, it was really icy and my son Jimmy come by this morning because he needed something and he said he was sliding all over the road so I thought oh, okay so I went back to bed but I did walk down my basement I did get my walk in because um, I didn't want to slip and slide outside and now it's really not good morning it's good afternoon because the sun is out and the ice is melted so it's it's okay to be driving now because I had a couple things I had to do and I had to go to Kroger's and you know blah 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 so we'll see how sunny it is it's it's nice out so I probably could have went for a walk out here I might still go for a walk later on today we'll see it's supposed to get colder as the day goes by but we do have two birthdays the first birthday in no particular order is Diana Wyatt. Today's her birthday, so Diana gets a song. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Diana. Happy birthday to you. Cha-cha-cha. Oh, great day. Great day. I hope you have a great day. I'm sure it's your birthday. Why wouldn't it be a great day? Jeez, oh, Pete. And then also we have Connie over at Connie X, or Connie B X one two three. I think that's what the name of her channel is. But it's Connie's birthday. She gets a song too. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Connie. Happy birthday to you. Cha cha cha. There's not very many people on the road, but the, the road seems fine. I don't foresee a problem here. Uh, I don't have to get a lot of stuff. I checked out my pantry and I'm going to eat from my pantry for the next couple weeks. Because, um, well, I want to make sure I got enough. We're supposed to get a snowstorm on Saturday, so I want to make sure that uh, I could probably just go after my Weight Watchers meeting. It's, we're supposed to the snow's not supposed to start till in the morning. My my meeting's at nine o'clock, so it'll just be at the beginning of the snow. But uh, that's when everybody waits to go and get all their stuff because they panic, I guess. I don't know. But I'm not panicking. I just need to get some stuff just in case. That's my plan. But, uh, so, the fish and chips last night was so good. It really was. It was really, I meant to film my brother and my sisters, but I forgot. I did get Denise, but, but it was funny. Mary picked a fish place that we went to. We went to Terry's Terrace, which is, uh, my son Danny used to work there. I remember when we I used to pick him up. Even in the winter, we'd have all the windows open, and I'd have like a sheet on the on the uh, seat that he sat on because oh, he just stunk of fish. It just smelled so bad, and uh, he just reeked of it. But I love fish and chips. So, and so now anyway, Mary. It was Mary's birthday, it's the 25th, and so she picked um, this fish place to go to, and then she orders prime rib, a prime rib sandwich. And Denise is like, because eh, eh, Denise doesn't like fish in any way, shape, or form. And so she said, why did we come to a fish place for you to get prime rib? Why wouldn't we have gone to a steak place or something like that? She says, I don't know. I just was going to have fish, but then I changed my mind because they make a really good prime rib sandwich. So, so it was fine with me because I love my fish and chips. And I know that, I forget who it was, somebody had said, they didn't look like they were going to stop for the light. Um... Somebody had said that they looked it up and the fish was 14 points for one, and I had two, so that was 28. But I went by a, I, the particular restaurant I went doesn't have fish and chips, so I went to different restaurant sites on my app, and then I figured out the one that had seemed like the closest to the uh, portion size that I was going to get whether it was right or wrong. I mean, whatever. I was going to have it no matter what, no matter how many points it was, which is not really the good way to look at this, but, uh, and like I said, I'm, I'm going to eat what I like, 
and uh, I only eat out twice a month. I, I used to eat out oh, a whole lot more than that, but uh, I don't do that anymore. It's not, uh, it's not conducive to my lifestyle now, because my lifestyle is to try to eat more foods at home. And you know, and truth be told, I think I'm a fairly good cook, and I like what I cook, and I think sometimes there are specialties that I get when I order out that I like better, I'll be honest with you, but I think for the most part, I, I make pretty good meals, and they're pretty healthy, and, and I enjoy them, so that's all, that, that's all that really matters, I guess. So, um, I have been reflecting a lot on my day before, and I think, you know, I reflected about yesterday, and I think I did pretty good. I am going to have that salad sometime today with the black beans, though, because um, I, uh, I I want it. And then I did read somewhere the reason you do rinse the beans is because it uh, washes off all the starches and the salt and things like that. And uh, that makes sense. So I'm glad I rinsed the beans off. I don't know what I want for dinner. I, I I kind of like that stir fry I made the last time with my uh, rice. So, um, and the and the bad thing is, is I'm going to the store hungry, and that's not good. You shouldn't go to the store hungry because you tend to buy more. But I have made a list, which I don't usually do. So I made a list. Uh, I have a budget, Kelly. You'll be happy to know. I have a budget to how much I'm going to spend, and uh, I'm going to stick to my list and not go over and uh, not be tempted. I'm, I'm going to go with blinders on. I'm just going to head to the aisles that I need to go to and not go up and down every aisle seeing if there's something I forgot on my list because uh, I'll, I'll end up spending more money that way. And, and, uh, I'm, I'm on a mission to uh, at least cut my food costs back a little bit. I, I spend way too much at Kroger's. story I could tell. Hmm. No, I just don't have anything. Sorry. I, I tried. I really did try to think of something, but I'm trying to think when I was going to school. Memories of that. I remember just silly, you know like silly things you remember. I remember that when we went back to school after Christmas break in 1961 my, sis, my friend Sue and I stomping out in the snow in 1961 because if you look at it upside down it still says 1961. It was just something weird. Weird things like that I remember. I don't understand that. I remember when we went for our kindergarten um, paper drive there was three kindergarten classes and when they were bringing the papers and we had like piles in the playground where we were supposed to put our papers and I wasn't sure what stack and so I put my stack on the wrong pile, and the stack I put it on, that class won. Our class lost. It was because of me. I remember that, too. Silly memories. I'm telling you, just silly memories. But, uh, oh. Okay, I, that's it. I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Well, look how late it is. Obviously, I'm only going to be eating two meals today. But I really wasn't hungry before now, but I'm hungry now. So I'm gonna have my usual breakfast. So I started my day with a prayer. I drank 60 ounces of water. My quote is, you can't go back and change the beginning, but you can start where you are and change the ending. 23 smart points, it's a seven point breakfast. Zero for my eggs, berries, banana, grapefruit tea and water. Three points for my four slices of center cut bacon. Three points for a half of a lender's bagel and one for point for a teaspoon of peanut butter it's a seven point breakfast so i have 16 points left for the rest of my day okay i obviously decided on a chicken stir fry so uh, i had nine points or i used nine points of my 16. 
I have green peppers, red peppers, mushrooms, broccoli, zucchini, carrots, and my chicken for zero points. Two points for my two slices of the naan bread. Seven points for a cup of brown rice, which is underneath all my stir fry. And zero for my tea water and my soy sauce. So it's nine points and I still have seven points left. You can see a little bit of my rice right there. But that's a lot of food, but it's mostly vegetables. Well, I had a busy day today. Um, I did a grocery haul. I'm sure you saw that by now. And um, Sophia, Christy stopped by after um, she picked up Sophia from school because uh, Sophia had a pink cast on, but now she has a blue cast on because the swelling on her arm went down so much that the cast was slipping on and off. So they took another x-ray and originally they had said she was supposed to wear the cast for another five weeks, but now they think it may be only be for three weeks. So she was very excited about her gift. So check out the uh, Sophia's Surprise Happy Mail because she was very, and she loves, loves unicorns. She's got unicorns all over her bedroom. She's got unicorn sheets. She's got a unicorn bedspread. <laughs> oh, I ruined it. I ruined the surprise. Now you know what she got. But uh, I um, don't have anything else to talk about. I really, I think I've talked about everything today. I, I did walk down the basement. I told you earlier today, I was going to go for a walk outside later on in the day. And I just got busy doing some other stuff, you know, around the house and talking on the phone and, you know, all that other good stuff. But, uh, I stayed on plan. Uh, that was a lot of vegetables on my plate. And I had one chicken breast. And then uh, I had like a green and yellow zucchini. I had a green zucchini and a yellow squash. And I had the carrots and the broccoli and the mushrooms and the green and red peppers and the rice. It was very filling. It was very filling. But it was so good. It really was really good. Uh, the, so the soy sauce was a little salty. So, um, but I don't weigh myself any, every day anyhow, so I won't weigh myself till Saturday, so I'll get rid of that little bit of sodium that I had from that. And then tomorrow I'll probably, I bought two pieces of chicken today, so tomorrow I'll probably just bake the other piece of chicken with a potato and some vegetables. And um, I'll probably have three meals tomorrow. I'll eat at a more decent time <laughs> because uh, I, it was just, I didn't eat my breakfast. I didn't eat my first meal of the day till almost 2.30, which was the old Sandy, but I just... I really wasn't that hungry this morning. I didn't get to sleep last night till like 3 o'clock in the morning. I was just like wide awake. So I was watching everything on TV. And then I went to bed. And then um, at 7.30, there was somebody was knocking on my front door. I'm like, who's knocking on my front door? It was Jimmy. He had uh, had a car problems in his uh, significant other. I don't know what to call her. They, they live together. Um, Samantha had brought him his keys because when he came out of the gym he realized he had locked his keys in the car and then for some reason his phone got put into her car and he needed it for work so he was coming here to use my phone to call her and um his key didn't work for I don't know why his key didn't work but his key didn't work to get in well then I went back to bed and then I had a wrong number at eight o'clock and then at eight thirty, somebody called my cell phone didn't recognize the number so I didn't answer it and then at 9 o'clock, I, I have a notification through my bank that tells me no one things cleared from the day before. And it started binging, 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 binging. <laughs> so finally, I thought, I'm just getting up. And then it was so icy, I couldn't walk. That's why I went down the basement. And we're supposed to get snow today, tonight. So I don't know that I'll be walking outside again tomorrow. But oh, I'll go back down the basement and walk again down there. I would rather walk in a circle in the basement than do a Leslie Sansone video. The Leslie Sansone video, I know it says it's walking. I mean, that's exercise. That's like, I don't know. I'm, and I'm not the least bit coordinated. I'm just so uncoordinated. But Okay, I'm going to go get my, what am I going to do? You know what, I'm going to go get my pajamas on, watch some TV. So I will talk to you guys tomorrow. So give this video a like, leave a comment, subscribe, and share it if you think somebody might like to see it. So I'll talk to you guys in the morning.